What is up guys, Jeremy here and welcome back to another iOS 11 video. We're taking a look at the new dark mode. Now it's not officially called dark mode, but it's pretty much dark mode and uh, it's something that Apple is working on. A lot of people were very disappointed that there was no official dark mode with iOS 11, but I'm pretty sure they have, you know, realized probably from everybody you know wanting the dark mode that this is what they're working towards and again like i've said in you know the previous video on how to get ios 11 this is beta one it is buggy they are still developing it there's going to be a lot of work to be done before its official release in the fall but anyways to enable this new dark mode within ios 11 we're going to jump into the settings here i'm going to back out and then we're going to go down to general Go into accessibility, go to display accommodations, and then go into the invert colors section. Now, normally there was just the invert colors, which was found on you know previous iOSs, but now there is a new smart invert. And like I said, I'm pretty sure this is what Apple is kind of testing or developing to be the official dark mode. So if we switch this on. It's a little buggy, as you guys can see, the toggles kind of switch from the regular invert back to their normal colors. We'll back out. I think that the menus look really good in this dark mode. As you guys can see, all the icons are kind of incorrect in color. Um, we can go ahead and close out, end it from multitasking. Go back into settings, and that should fix the look of it. Of course, all this stuff is buggy. I'm going to keep mentioning that this is beta. Things are buggy in beta, but take a look at settings with the smart invert on. I think that's a really good look. It's pretty much dark mode. Uh, pretty much just the text and the background of settings is, you know, uh, changed. And then all of the icons remain, remain the same. So definitely a very cool look, you know, it being dark mode. Now with this smart invert on, it makes the dock look really funny. It's kind of a blue color. So hopefully they can like switch that to just be normal or even a dark kind of uh, blur effect to it would be really cool. Uh, we can open up the App Store. I think the App Store looks really good in dark mode as well. Also keep in mind, guys, uh, not all the applications are going to look, you know, normal, especially third-party applications with this enabled. It can make, you know, stuff look really funky. I don't think that this is really usable yet as a, you know... Uh, a normal setting to have on and to be using your applications uh, you know it just looks weird for some like I said but you know even uh, the the app store here looks really good in a dark mode I think it's a really cool look and you know I hope that Apple you know slowly develops this before the uh, official release in the fall and makes this the official dark mode because I would really love to have a dark mode that looks really good like this on my device and uh, you know doesn't mess with third-party apps doesn't mess with images and stuff like that where it just brings only the dark mode so I wanted to show you guys that real quick here in this video I hope you guys enjoyed the iOS 11 dark mode aka smart invert uh, but anyways if you guys enjoyed this video definitely throw me a thumbs up that helps me out a lot here at the channel and if you guys want to see more videos like this in the future don't forget to click that subscribe button this has been Jeremy and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Later.